Good morning. I've had some requests. Not like thousands, but um, I will get around to them. I'm just doing things here that need doing. So while I'm doing it, I thought I'd talk to you. So today we're going to quickly do planting up seedlings because I know some of you will be ready to plant up seedlings soon. These are tomatoes. They have been going since, um, and it is important to get your uh, marking right. No, that says broad beans. They've been going since the 27th of January. So they were in smaller modules and then they were transplanted up into slightly bigger ones. And the trick with tomatoes is, I'm not going to give you any historical things on tomatoes, we're just planting seedlings today, is when you're planting up the very the small ones, put them in a bigger pot and then plant them up to a part way up the stem. And what that does is it makes it makes better roots to come it makes more roots come out and um, it just gives uh, the tomatoes a bit more strength. Now I have heard those tricks with tomatoes like digging a half a metre trench and putting rotten fish heads in it. Um, I haven't tried it, I haven't got my hands on any rotten fish heads. I might give it a go though uh, in the future. So um, where I'm planting them today is there used to be lettuce here so this is on a rotational system and lettuce are light feeders tomatoes are medium to heavy feeders uh, they like a lot of nutrition uh, but the main thing I wanted to show you today was when you're transplanting so I've got gloves because my delicate little hands you know <laughs> um, and the soil here is it's pretty good it's like loamy and um, quite loose, which is nice for the, the plants. It has been, uh, there's been compost added to it. Um, and yeah, it's pretty good shape. So when you're transplanting, um, think of it like a little baby, you know. So you want to loosen the pot, and I will move the camera in a minute. And then you're going to very gently tip the pot over. And there should be good root formation. Look at that. Now don't do this in the middle of the day. These tiny little hairs absolutely hate sunshine and light. I'm, I'm traumatizing them right now, so I'm going to put them in the ground. So I'm loosening them up a tiny little bit, gently place it in the ground, and then try not to plant them kind of too deep. Uh, hang on, let me get the camera. So professional. My camera person's a bit bad. Okay, so now we've got it in the ground can you see that i hope you can see that okay so when i'm putting it in the ground i'm not going to jam it down into the ground i'm actually going to lightly put soil around it press it a little firmly in there but not be like people tend to be people tend to be a bit rough when it comes to transplanting things and actually like moving house you're 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 not in like you're in a bit of a delicate headspace so be be kind when you're transplanting be careful make sure it's nice and loose and um, very gently, don't like, you know, don't do that. So that's about transplanting today. I'm gonna go away, but when I come back, I'll, I'll have some interesting facts and weird stuff for you. Bye. 